हेलो माय नेम इज लाबोनी दत्तो एंड आई एम अ फाइनल ईयर स्टूडेंट ऑफ बायोमेडिकल इंजीनियरिंग डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ नेताजी सुभाष इंजीनियरिंग कॉलेज एंड टुडे आई विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट माय फाइनल ईयर प्रोजेक्ट डेवलपमेंट ऑफ हीमोस्टैटिक फिल्म फ्रॉम मैरी गोल्ड लीफ एक्सट्रैक्ट परफॉर्म अंडर द गाइडेंस ऑफ डॉक्टर सुजन कृष्ण सामंतो एज वी ऑल नो दैट मेरी गोल्ड लीव हैव बीन यूज ऑन कट्स एंड वूम्स टू स्टॉप ब्लीडिंग सिंस एंशंट टाइम्स so we have tried to evaluate the efficacy of marigold leaf extracts in blood clotting by conducting various tests and trials we have chosen to do our project on this unconventional topic by using marigold leaves as our test specimen because they are readily available and also because the cost for manufacturing the artificial coagulant from marigold leaves is much less than the available synthetic coagulants in the market from studying the blood coagulation pathway we can see that calcium acts as a catalyst so we have used hydroxyapatite which is a salt rich in calcium to see the dual effect of hydroxyapatite and marigold leaves uh, in blood coagulation first we have prepared an extract from the marigold leaves and then we have synthesized hydroxyapatite in our lab to verify the standards of hydroxyapatite we have done two studies which is xrd study and X ftir analysis to see uh, if the prepared sample is according to the standards then we have done tests like the prothrombin time test to see that the marigold leaf extract gives faster plasma coagulation then we have done the simulated body fluid analysis to see that the extract is biocompatible and we have also done a test by applying the extract on human wound and calculating the bleeding time to see that the bleeding time is reduced when the extract is applied and further reduced when the extract in coag in conjunction with hydroxyapatite is applied from these tests we can conclude that marigold leaves are an effective blood coagulant and their efficacy even increases when they are used in conjunction with hydroxyapatite which contains calcium Finally I want to thank our project guide Dr Sujan Krishna Samanto for constantly guiding us throughout the course of the project I would also like to thank the HOD of Biomedical Engineering Department Dr Shomir Kumar Ghosh our mentor Mr Tarok Das and the professors and faculty of Biomedical Engineering Department for their constant support and encouragement thank you to everyone